Welcome to my step-by-step -step guide to unlock the Roller Beetle mount in Guild Wars 2. To unlock the Roller Beetle, you have to complete three different collections individually. It can be a bit time-consuming since you have to do meta events, world bosses and more. But if you follow this guide, you'll get it done in a day or two tops. The timers are the worst part since you have to wait for world bosses to spawn. The farmable parts of the collections only takes around 3 hours or 2 to unlock the, all the collections. Now, first of all, we need to have the episode Long Live the Lich, for arm is forewarned. After the second mission, at the beginning of Tactile Triage, speak to Spear Marshal Zayn to get things started. After speaking to Spear Marshal Zayn, you have to find Gorik and speak to him to unlock the first collection of the Roller Beetle. In the first collection, you have to find several secret caches spread around the domain of Korna. After that, you speak to Gorik again and he'll give you the last item. Now that we have collected everything, we deliver it to Gorik and we'll start the second collection. First item of the second collection is in Daviji Hollows. We we'll have to kill Inquest and farm the item. And then we have to hack into a terminal that's inside the cave. Afterwards, we have to pick a bounty from the boards and kill it. You'll then receive the third item. After that, you'll have to find several items spread across Tyria. In Lorna's Pass, you have to kill the mecha mobs to find the fourth item. Then, you'll do your first world boss, the Leyline Anomaly. If you go to the Guild Wars 2 wiki, you'll find the event timers there. The second world boss is in Mount Maelstrom. You have to kill the Inquest Golem. Again, you can go to the wiki to find the event timers. Now, back to Domain of Kurma, you'll have to go to the front lines and farm Inquest Gold here. After collecting all the items, head back to Gorik and talk to Blish and the Beetle.
the third and final collection is now unlocked. For the first item in the third collection, you'll have to go to the front lines again. There, you'll find the, the event Trample Scarab, which will give you the first item. The second item you'll find in the Meta event in Domain of Kurna. You can try and find a raid in Looking for Group to make things faster. You shouldn't have any problem completing these events. After finishing the event, you have to smash some canisters that will give you the second item from the third collection. For the next item, you have to kill Junundu worms. The best spot to find them is in Desolation. Next item is in Far Silverwastes on the top side of the map. You have to go to this corner and try to activate the event where the champion beat the spot. Now back to main of Kurna. In the top left side, you have to go to this pond and swim to the bottom. There, you will, you will kill another worm that will give you the next item. We are almost done. Now go to Kessex Hills and kill a champion spider to get another item. After that, you go back to Domain of Kurna, where you will buy the last item that you need. Finally, you go back to Gorik and talk to the beetle, and you will unlock the roller beetle mount. If you enjoyed the guide, please leave a like and sub for more Guild Wars 2 content. See you next time.